The harvest is in full swing at the Venetia plantation. The ripe coffee beans have to be picked and processed as quickly as possible. Coffee production is a key industry in Colombia. But the cafeteros have been facing disaster for years. With falling prices on the world market, many farmers are close to bankruptcy. And now they're facing a crisis of a different sort. A plague of destructive black beetles is causing huge losses. The biggest problem here in the region is the coffee borer beetle, a tiny insect that causes tremendous damage to coffee beans. It bores into them and lays its eggs there. The beetle larvae hatch in them and make the beans unsellable. Then the larvae develop into beetles, fly away and do the same to other plants. This is the Colombian Research Center run by Bayer Crop Science, a subsidiary of the German pharmaceuticals giant. The scientists here are working hard to develop a pesticide against the beetle. There is no effective way to fight infestations. When developing new chemicals for use in pest control, you must be quicker than the competition. Thanks to the climatic conditions in Colombia, we're able to conduct tests and gather data here all year long. And we can use that information in BEA's projects all over the world. In addition, we're able to address the specific problems faced by the farmers here. Colombia's farmers want to sell more of their products abroad. And that means that they have to learn more about international norms. Oranges exported, for example, to Europe are subject to very strict regulations. Beatriz Arieta heads a Bayer teaching program called Agrovida. It trains farmers in a variety of agricultural methods, including the right way to treat orange trees with highly toxic substances to protect them from fungal infestation. Programs like these ensure that the farmer's produce can acquire the necessary certification for sale in the EU, and they also help protect the environment. Every year we train around 22,000 people to use pesticides safely. This project is supported by every member of Bayer's international sales staff. Every sales representative at Bayer is also responsible for ensuring that users are given the information they need to use the products properly. One of Bayer's most important production facilities in Latin America can be found at the municipality of Barranquilla on the Colombian coast. Around 160 staff members work in several shifts a day here. The agrochemical sector is booming as more land is devoted to agriculture in countries all over the world. But many companies want a slice of this growing market. Frank Dietrich, the head of Bayer operations in Colombia, is up against both U.S. and Swiss chemicals companies so his prices have to convince. Barranquilla is a very competitive location because the people who we train there ourselves are highly qualified. And the geographic location is also good strategically. From here we can serve not only the Colombian market but also the Andes region, Venezuela, Ecuador, Peru and even the export markets of Brazil and Argentina. It allows us to adjust quickly to the needs of those markets. Today's crop of coffee beans from the Venezia plantation is ready for delivery. The workers here are hoping for a good harvest and rising prices. And of course, that the plague of beetles will soon end. The company that can offer a pesticide to make that happen more quickly is certain to do well in Colombia.